wasn't planning on starting my next vlog today, uh, but I got something in the mail and it kind of confuses me because it was shipped to my home address. And I don't know, I'm kind of freaking out because I don't know who it is. Um, I didn't recognize the person, like the sender address, but sometimes that can kind of be confusing too. But it's this beautiful box that says Leslie on it. And I'm a little tempted. Um, I don't know. Let me, I guess I'll open this up. I've been filming, so I'm in a cute Crazy Nate merch, little softies, and I got my slippers. I was wearing leggings, but then leggings and the slippers, and I was like, oh, it's too hot. Too hot. Okay. Um, I'm just propping you guys up. <laughs> Wait, take a moment to appreciate that because my mom did that. <laughs> um okay so let me i want to look cute though in case i really want to show this off later like okay no sorry that's the bed this okay this is crazy let me get you guys back up because i was doing something else so i had you guys lower okay this is good oh i got hair in my mouth sorry i'm sporadic so kind of to give wait let's see am i good with you guys it good enough. You guys don't need to see my face. <laughs> you just need to see my body and what I'm about to show you. So, um, I got something in the mail and I got really afraid. I was really afraid actually, because when I looked at the sender name, I had no idea who that was. And I was like, okay, obviously like nine out of 10 times it's medicine, you know, cause this was, was not shipped to my PO box. It was shipped to my home address. So then I open it and this box, well, I don't want, the box, like, I'll insert a picture here, says Leslie on it. And again, like, I'm not thinking anything of this, <laughs> except for the fact that I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm like, uh-oh, like, you know, like, this is this does not look like anything I picked out on my Amazon wish list. And that was, again, supposed to go to my P.O. box. Shop my Amazon, shop my Amazon wish list. So I realized it was a... Will you be my bridesmaid box from Brie? So I did take some footage of getting my initial reactions, which I'll do like a really quick highlight reel. One second. Okay, says Leslie. Will you be my bridesmaid? Oh my goodness, wait, wait. <laughs> I know the name. Oh my gosh, I'm getting asked to be a bridesmaid. <laughs> this is so cute oh my gosh it i have a feeling it is my best friend brie from college I, i'm so glad i filmed this she like probably knew like leslie's probably gonna film this chocolate <laughs> she's probably rolling her eyes right now i love this wait i just want to make sure now i got a blow pop the cute writing here and you guys are back uh but i also realized the kitchen lighting is not that great and this here is greatness so I really wanted to take the time to walk you guys through it uh, so those are my initial reactions uh, <laughs> from fear to happiness but uh okay so this I just put here to kind of cover it but I opened it up and like you can see the wrapping paper it's just rainbow sparkles it's real pretty it kind of just reminds me of fun Betty and then says, will you be my bridesmaid? Uh, let me get a picture with this. So there you go, super cute. Ah, wait, there's the camera. Ah, eh. <laughs> So you saw a lot of my really excited reactions was towards the candy, <laughs> which I love. To me, I'm someone like, you always throw fun candy in things, of course. And then she got these little hair clips which is funny because I have been really using these hair clips. So I'm wondering if she has been or if she just liked the little fun accents or something. But one of them, wait, here's one. Where's the other one? Let me see. So we have black. We have a brown. I wouldn't say it's full on tortoise shell because there's not printed. Um, again, you guys, you guys have seen black and brown hair clips. But look at this one. This one is a matte blue. And it's so funny because Brie, when she does her nails, a lot of times she does opt for the matte version. That's kind of her thing. This is kind of the something blue I think she wanted to throw in. And it's actually kind of fancy because it has like these internal teeth to really hold on to your hair. So that's fun. I think she just kind of wanted a little ha <laughs> and threw it in uh, just because I know her sometimes she's kind of like, 
<laughs> so that could be it. And then this face mask, which I have a feeling like in general, like face masks, they're cute, they're fun. Who doesn't want one? But also I think this pays homage to our Korea trip for sure. Uh, Cause that was the last time we were all together. And then more candy. <laughs> I love this bubble gum. I won't, I'm so bad with these though, that when I pop one in my mouth, I look around and there's like five more. I'll shove all like, to have like all six in my mouth and that's not pretty on camera. That's not gonna give me views. So, um, need to swallow. I got this candle. Don't mind this on here. It kinda, this is like the outer casing, like the plastic. So it kind of, the tape got stuck to the tissue paper and I'm trying to work to get it off. Basically though, there's no point. I need to just unwrap the candle and it smells like pumpkin spice. Um, they always have like a zillion flavors. They're just, it's just very autumn smelling and it's perfect just cause like, even if I don't light it, I'll just smell it all the time. I'm <laughs> one of those people. Um, I don't know. It's like I, when you light a candle, it eventually goes away. So I don't know if I want to do that. And then this, okay, my initial reaction to this was that it was like a body wash or something. And then we have some, which is, I, don't know, I don't know what it is yet, but it's a nice product. Or do I drink it? Oh, I think I drink it. <laughs> I, I thought it, I was like, is this a body wash? But then I was like, this is pretty liquidy. <laughs> and it just keeps saying like Sutter Home Family Vineyards. Like white Zinfandel, California. Like, I don't know what that is. I'm so not classy. <laughs> And then it hit me, I was like, oh, this is wine. So this is super cute. I'm kind of wondering if this wine will be a theme throughout the party, um, the vision behind this. Maybe I'll need to just FaceTime Brie. I still need to respond yet. Um, and then with, in this little cute bag, I'm hoping, see the ring light can be trippy on you guys, but it says, I can't tie the knot without you. And this, this satchel alone is so cute, but it has this, and like, I don't know if what I'm, I don't know, my, I'm all, I didn't expect this, okay? <laughs> so I'm trying to, like, I've already kind of talked about this when I was in the kitchen, but well, first off, of course, it makes sense that this is rose gold. That's one of Brie's top favorite metals. And I don't think, I don't know if she did this on purpose. Maybe she was thinking of me, but my wrists are so small. So it's so nice to have something one second, there you go. <laughs> that I can squeeze and make it fit me. And it's so cute. So I'll have to, I'll probably make it a little bit tighter so it can fit real petite around here. But I love it. It is so cute. Um, so maybe I can make sure, well, I don't know what the bridesmaid's dress is. I don't know, I'm hoping like I can wear this, like a little accent piece, like if all of us girls could, that'd be super cute. Like I'd be into that, but she can do whatever she wants. And it's kind of hard because I would totally be up in her business with a camera vlogging all about this because that's how I am. Uh, but she's all the way in Connecticut. Uh, and granted, maybe she doesn't really want me up in her business filming stuff. But I had to show this off because this is super cute. So, um, like, again, um, my thought process is that I need to DM her personally because I know Haley is getting this because she kind of like pretty much said like you're going to be getting something but it was like a few weeks ago so I kind of forgot because that's the way I roll. <laughs> so um, I just, you know, I was traveling for two weekends in a row so I just kind of was disembobulated. So um, I don't know, like of course I want to post this on social media right away but I don't want to spoil anything from Haley especially if that's what Bree's wishes are. So I'm just going to be chill about it and just dig on Brie. Okay, that's really crazy. But you know what? This is a great way to start off the vlog. <laughs> so welcome to my channel. One of my best friends is Brie and she was an awesome roommate. Awesome time in all aspects. We did studying together, which was actually fun. Typical Starbucks runs, bike rides. I don't think we were in classes together, but we did clubs together, but we also went dancing together and took photos. So pretty much to describe Brie, I don't wanna say like she's up for anything because that kind of friend has sometimes negative context, like that girl's up for anything. But basically she's very well-rounded and fun and brains and she's pretty, so that's, that's awesome too. So 
I'm just looking forward to seeing Brie. And I've gone to meet her fiance multiple times. His name is Pete. Well, I call him Pete. She calls him Peter. And, oh, and sometimes I call him Pete Twire, and I think he's still okay with that. Uh, he's awesome, super nice, and it's just been a good time. So <laughs> I'm all over the place. Um, so you guys, it'll be a while before the wedding happens, and I'm not for sure about like the events leading up to that. Uh, so I'll try to share with you guys what I can, because especially if she's my best friend, she's now your best friend. Yeah.